Welcome back to the channel. It's Monday, which means we need to get to the daily challenges. We've already completed one on the first day of this festival playlist, so let's get into the next ones. Sneaky but speedy. Earn five speed skills in a game of hide and seek. That took a turn. Um, <laughs> suited up. Equip the camo race suit in the character customizer. We already have that. We'll make it happen again, I guess. Utility in demand. Take a photo of the 1955 Chevrolet 150 utility sedan. And finally, today's daily challenge, undercover operations. Win a street race. All right, so we got our work cut out for us. <laughs> Let's get to a game of hide and seek. Wow, that's crazy. Right away. So looking at it this way, the festival playlist wants us to complete a game of hide and seek. So I'm just going to enter in through this just to make sure we get credit. There we go. Seeker Mulehe. So this is always the question. What should we use here? Now, I like to look at ones that have all-wheel drive. Now, we, we drove the Lambo last time, so we can't do that again. Um, the GTR does not have off-road tires. Hmm. Let's use this. Screw it. All right, so as you can see, the radar thing at the bottom shows us they're in this general direction, which we are driving, and it is foggy. That sucks. Apparently, I am the slowest of the bunch by a great deal. Let's see if that continues onto the rally portion. Looks like no. Looks like I'm doing okay. We're heading in the right direction. Okay. The hider is very nearby. Okay, behind me. Very cool. They're probably just ripping out of here. Oh no. This is a tough... Okay. Whoa, this sucks. Five speed skills, so... Maybe I just rip on it for a while and try to get my speed skills. Oh, no hider, keep looking. Damn it. This, this sucks with, with it being so foggy at nighttime, dude. This is crazy. Way harder than it was last time. I don't even see a car. Hider has been pinged. Okay, finally. Somebody got close enough. Let's go get this dude. Okay, so it's a... He's in, like, stealth mode. What is this? A Ford... What is it, a raptor? Oh, that guy ate a rock, dude. He's going to hit me with Chase Breaker probably very soon. Why are they hitting me? What the heck, you stupid teammate? Lord. That guy hit a jump. Oh, my gosh. That was wild. I can still see him, kind of. Where did he go? Where did he go? Oh dang, I just used my ping again. He wasn't here. He is just ripping. This will help me get my speed skills I need though. Slowly catching. Meter is filling. There it is. Okay. Oh, pinged. Nice. Oh, I got hit by a chase breaker. How? The guy behind me too. Damn. That sucks. All right. At least we got a ping. That's definitely close. Okay. Here's what I'll say. Don't hit the ping unless your meter is completely full. Meter's got to be full or it's a waste. The ping is ended. As soon as I get a full circle ping. There we go. That was, that was key. That was key. That was sick. No hider, keep looking. I pinged him, dog. Somebody did. We won. There you go. All right. Did we get five speed skills, though? That's the question. There it is. Hide and seek complete. Oh, my gosh. We did not get five speed skills. So that means we have to play another game. Oh, my gosh. Jumping in again. And this time, this is where I think this challenge sucks. You could keep playing to win and to help your teammates but I've already done that once 
I need to get five speed skills. So <laughs> you're incentivizing people to just go rogue and do challenges in the game of hide and seek. Makes no sense. Watch me be the seeker or the the hider. I have not been the hider yet. All right, so we're seeker again. This time, Guanajuato, and hmm, seven four. Nothing's higher than seven four except for the Lamborghini. This has seven one speed. Oh my gosh! Let's try the Land Cruiser, Arctic trucks, whatever. I can't believe it says it has seven one speed. So we're trying to get speed skills, guys. We'll head, we'll head this way. I don't know why that guy went right. But if you guys see a speed skill pop up, let me know. Oh, oh, thank you. Mm, that was bad. This thing sounds like it has a big V8. This is nuts. In the city is terrible. Absolutely terrible. Can't wait till I get outside the city. I'm just going to run, run my speed skills. This is the one from the trailer, though. Guanajuato. Can you even get outside the city? Not like that. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna try and earn my speed skills. This was not the car to do speed skills in. I'm way up over a hundred. How can I not be getting speed? <laughs> that was awesome. This thing sounds absolutely terrible. It really does. I can't believe I'm going 90 though. Out through here. Where is speed? Speed! I finally got one. One. Speed. I'm going like 120. There's no way I'm getting speed skills. I'm just going to probably enter the, the fray. End zone is now active. I don't know what that means. Oh, they got to get to the end zone. Okay. That makes a lot of sense. They might just be going slow, so I'm going to try and just head that way. Give a nice ping. No hider. Keep looking. That's hilarious. I literally had a full circle. So maybe that strat's not the best. So basically, if you're a hider, you just have to wait it out until the end zone opens up. And they're going to win now. We don't have any secret detection. This is wild. Whatever you do, don't pick this vehicle. So I thought this was all inclusive, but I guess it's a total across all your games of hide and seek. So I was able to get a couple speed skills in that one. So, and then that added to what I already had. I definitely did not get five in the last one. So you just need five total. You can get one. In each game of hide and seek, you can get one in every other game of hide and seek. Eventually, you will get it. So that's cool. Like I said, now we need to hit suited up, equip the camo race suit and the character customizer. If you guys didn't already know, I already have that on, I believe. And no, I don't. Okay. I think I meant to. I could have swore I did. I really could have swore I did. But here we go. Notification incoming. And there it is, suited up, complete. Now moving on to utility in demand. Take a photo of the 1955 Chevrolet 150 utility sedan, and I will bring my character out so we can see that lovely race suit as well. So a Chevy 150. Of course, we need to go to Chevrolet, and I'm also going to tab to the right because then that puts us with the old Chevrolets. There's the 150, but we also have this monstrosity. I got as a tune for a... Uh, trial or something threw a livery on it it's super low it's on drag tires it's not that terrible it's gonna take a great picture i know that so we're gonna slide in here whoa this thing does slide good lord so super cool throw it sideways oh wait 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 we got to be sitting still 
to get the character out. And there he is. Let's get right in his face. Whoa. How'd I do that? There's a man in there. What's up, dude? That's so cool. <laughs> Let's see if we can get a picture of me and this dude. <laughs> I never took a picture of the 150. That is absolutely hilarious. Easter egg. But you guys didn't know that, did you? Why would you? I didn't know. Celebratory donuts. Losing RPM. Anyway, it didn't give us a notification, but there you go. All of them done except for undercover operations. Win a street race. Let's go do that. Um, I always go Route to Norte. So today, I'm actually going to mix it up a little bit. Let's get rid of everything except for the street racing events. And that one's not the one I want. Is this one? No. Let's do this one. This looks pretty cool. So from here, I always complain about what they give us as far as recommended vehicles. And I think I'm going to have to agree. Those are pretty trash. This one is good. If you're like looking for something that really handles, maybe I'll use it. I've, I might be, I might have talked myself into it. Yeah, let's do it. It's just not, it's just not my cup of tea. It's got the teammate livery. I don't like the wheels. Everything about it just screams you're trying to accomplish something, you know? Everything serves a purpose here. We're trying to stay at B700. It does handle great. We'll see how it does in this street race, though. I feel like if you're coming to a street race, you got to have something fast and furious. Something rowdy. It's kind of the whole point, right? Need for speed underground-y. Let's get rid of these radio stations. We don't have that on this channel. There we go. We don't want to get popped for copyright infringement. Whatever. So, there's definitely two packs here, and I'm in the middle. Whoa! Yes! Sometimes, the traffic works out for you in a street race, and that was one of them. We are next to an electric vehicle that is an off-road only racer. And they're passing us, and I'm in this. Tell me how that makes sense. You're right. Ding, ding, ding. It doesn't. We are all-wheel drive, so we can mitigate the uh, sandy condition off to the right there. And what is in front? What happened? That guy is checked out. Is it an extreme E? Because I'm going to lose it. Yes, it is. Worst cars in the game. Terrible. Funny enough, the one of the few... Festival playlist series I got all gold in back when I used to do seasonal championships. 38%. We got to watch it now because this guy is still in front. We don't want to make any mistakes. Look at that. Nice. Oh, to the inside. And there we are. Halfway. Let's continue this on here through the smoke what is it the flares yeah the flares the smoke monsters this thing sounds pretty good when you let off it does sound like a race car it is a GT1 car so that makes sense I can't believe how fast this car is and how well it handles. And in the game, it's only B700. Just goes to show your street ride is probably a D. D497, if that. That's an uncomfortable truth for the Forza Horizon 5 racer. That's why we race on the game, because in real life, we don't have S1 or A. Maybe you do. Maybe you're one of the few out there with a Z06 or something wild. There it is. That's it. Throwing it across. Backwards. Showing the uh, Union Jack. There it is. Finished first. El Lago Blanco. Maybe one of the new street scene events that we can uh, take advantage of. 25. Not bad. Not bad. But well, let's look at it. Let's take a look at these daily challenges. All of them complete except for two. 
Three, two, one. If you know, you know. Earn three stars at launch control danger sign. That's funny. And testing grounds. Play any event lab from the creative hub. Why couldn't you be out before Sunday? Anyway, I'm no stranger to him. I'll play another one. It doesn't matter. It's pretty easy. That's just funny, though. Like I said the other day, we're going to be going to Autumn Storm Season on Thursday. We get the brand new Subaru WRX. We'll see if it's any good. And if it's not, we'll make it good. Um, apparently, people wanted the Sierra 700R. It's back. We have a Cuda. We have a Jesco in the shop. Horizon Arcade. The Trial. Two Event Labs. Four PR Stunts. Treasure Hunt. Hide and Seek. Horizon Open. Photo Challenge. Fun stuff. And I did say maybe we'll hit one of the uh, monthly rivals. That'll be really cool as well. Looking forward to it. Hopefully you guys are too. Thank you so much for watching. And I will be back tomorrow in the next one. Later.